Okay, I had to uh, take two of the wheels off so that I could go ahead and drill the, uh, the holes for where they're going to be in the bottom of the new torsion box. If you ever wonder why a torsion box is such an awesome idea, let's just take a quick look underneath this old one that I've got. As you can see, it is nothing more than just standard 2x4 construction. That's all there is to it. Uh, under here, there's actually 2x4s on their sides. Um, and then sandwiched up again. But the main rails run here and here. And if you look down there, you'll see a jack. One single jack holding up this whole side. When I jack it up, it, uh, it actually picked up the whole box. I put this old uh, jack stand underneath it just to be cautious, but here, I'm gonna reach up here and I'm pulling down. <laughs> Believe it or not, I am pulling down as hard as I can and you see that box barely moves. So that is why a torsion box is so great, is because when one piece, you know, it takes, to move the whole thing, it takes quite a bit because it all just kind of move as one. Uh, so you greatly reduce the amount of movement that you have. Now this here is my old torsion box. You can see there's not really a lot of cross support. There is quite a bit more in the middle. Uh, but here on the ends, no, there's really nothing. So now the new one, which has quite a bit more uh, support, should be, in theory, a whole lot stronger and even more stable.